Hey y'all, welcome back to Amber's Journey. My name is Amber and today we are going to do some planning and my dashboard social media planner. If you are coming back, thank you so much for supporting me and if you're new here, thank you for stopping by. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe down below um, and then that way you'll see all of the content and that notification bell. So today what I'm going to use is two kits, I guess you could say. This is the Planner Life Kit from Sprinkled to Bits. I really like the deco in this. It has the coffees and the florals and different things. And then it has the Monday through, uh, Monday through Sunday here. And then I have this one sheet that I got from Lisa Lorraine Plans and a grab bag. This is kind of coffee themed and things like that. So I'm going to go ahead and use this as well. I think that the colors match pretty well with the browns and the pinks. So I'm going to go ahead and use these today. So what I'm going to do first is white out all the things that I'm going to cover up. So obviously I don't have bills to pay with social media. I don't need any emails or anything there. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and white out the days because I'm going to cover those up with what's in the kit and get that going. How's everybody doing today? I hope everybody is fantastic. I am really excited. We are going to be doing a giveaway once I hit 200 subscribers and we're really close to it. So stay, stay tuned for that. I'll do a video on that once we hit that mark to get everything going there. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna start with the days. So let's go ahead and lay these down. Now in September, I plan on doing my setup a little bit different. If you guys saw my planner lineup, you know that originally I had used the dashboard for my work and I just felt like I didn't need that much space for work. With work, it's a little bit uh, monotonous. It's pretty much the same thing every day. So I don't really need this much space for it. All right, I'm having some trouble with these stickers. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lay these down and then I'm gonna come back and show you what I'm doing. All right, y'all, I'm back. I got my dates down here. I had a little bit of trouble with the sticker sheets. They were cut a little bit too deep, so I went ahead and put them in here to use so that way it doesn't take up a whole lot of time on the filming part of it. So I'm going to stick these to the side here. Um, so the first thing that I want to do is make sure that I put down what I need for the week. So the days that I usually post videos is Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. So I'm going to go ahead and put these down for those videos so I can plan those out. This will be the ones that I post, and then the ones that I film and all that will go over in the list here to get that going. <clears throat> and then I want to put some headers up here, so I'm going to go ahead and cover this up. the labels and then I'm going to put one here as well to plan content. This would be like ideas and filming and all that. Um, I'm going to put a little checklist on Saturday and then you know what I should put the, this week sticker here. Let's see if I can get this one up and use it. Ooh, like butter, y'all. Really like that came up really easy. So I'm gonna put it this week up here instead. All right, so that's the beginning of it there. And then I wanna put my functionals down and then I'm gonna put the deco of the other kit down. So I'm gonna put the weekend banner at the very bottom here. Still need room to write when it comes to social media. I do most of my stuff on the weekend when it comes to filming and editing and all that. So I'm going to put that there, get stuff done and put that here. And then important, the 
this over here. Make sure we're still in that. And then my habit trackers. This is going to be film and post. I'm going to mark what I'm doing there. I do have some stickers for that too. Okay, and then I'm gonna put a little header here. Okay, so we're good there. So let's put in some deco and then we'll work around that. So I really want to use this big strip here. I think it is so cute. I think I'm gonna put it up here though. Just like covering that focus up. I love this kit, it's so beautiful. And I'm going to put this one down here on Sunday. Okay, and then this little torn piece. I'm going to put down here. Oh, I probably won't need all of those, so I'm going to put it here. It's so cute. And then you have this little like stamp looking sticker. I don't know if you guys can see that. It says hope on it and then it has like a little comfy couch. I'm gonna go ahead and put that over here on Wednesday. I just think it's so cute. I'm gonna put it right here between Monday and Wednesday. And then there's a lot to this kit and it's a journaling kit. Um, Planner Life, I'm gonna put that up here. And then this says work hard, dream big. I'm going to layer that here. And you know what? Let me see something. If I can get it back up. No, nope, it's there. I already went down. It decided it wanted to stay. <laughs> I really like these little windows. I need to put something like behind it or something. Let's see. Coffee behind it. Yes, I like that. So we're going to do it like that and layer them like that. this over here. Let me do it like that. So you got the little window with the coffee in it. I'm going to use these little decos here to brighten up over here. These ones are tiny so I'm going to use these around the top. I love these little coffees. I'm obsessed with coffee anyway, so I just think this is adorable. And then let's go ahead and put these florals right here. And then we have this little vase too. I'm going to put this over here. These kits are really going good together. I'm really excited about that. <laughs> um, and I like these little strips here. Let's see what we can stick those in at. Might have some left over, but that's okay. We could strip these over here. Just cover up that white out. I think that's adorable. And I have little bean plant for the coffee which is so cute so I'm just gonna decorate this whole section over here because I don't need it for anything else Let's see the little plant there got a little cupcake back 
here. All right, and then I have these scripts. Um, normally I don't put those on my social media. I guess we'll see. Let me use this little one. It's cute. All right, so that's what I'm gonna use from that for now. And then I might just put it back into my thing here. So I think I'm gonna put this on Friday so I can start a list of what I need. And then got more torn strips. I think I'm gonna save that. I like this little window. And then these little planners. I think that's it for what I need because what I'm going to do is the videos I post go here over here I'm going to keep track of film post or maybe like Facebook IG posts that's what I'm gonna do Facebook and IG here and then this will be my planned film and then what I actually put out and then this is going to be filming and editing and this is going to be a list of ideas for the next week so that way I can keep on top of it. And then I have a little list here of what I actually do on Saturday to get ready for the next week. And I have quite a few pieces left over, which is awesome. So I'll go ahead and save these for another spread or could even use them as deco at some point in another spread. So I'm gonna combine these together. And then whatever's left on the other page, I'll just put into my functionals because it's mostly scripts and um, checklists and boxes, which I'm sure I'll use at some point. So we'll go ahead and do that and put that in my reusable sticker book here, which I'll do that off camera. But um, we did go ahead and use most of this. So that's awesome. So that is going to be my social media planner for the week. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have not already, please like and subscribe. Let me know what you thought of the video. Let me know what you think of the kits. Um, I really enjoy Sprinkled a Bits. I do have some problems with her cutting on the, the sheets. I don't know if it's just me or the few that I've gotten. I've had some issues, but once I get them off, they're beautiful. The quality of the actual stickers are amazing. Um, and then with Lisa Lorraine plans, I absolutely love her shop too. Her stickers are amazing. They're like super easy to write on and I've never had any issues before. So I hope that you guys like this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.